When it comes to the animal kingdom, these classic animal-themed treats are one of the best. They're a celebration of springtime, and no Easter basket would be complete without them. We're talking Peeps. Peeps is the number one candy that's put in an Easter basket, and that's what fans are always looking for. It all started back in the 1950s, when Bob Bourne of the Just Born Company in Bethlehem, Pennsylvania, revolutionized his family business by mechanizing the creation of the company's quirky little candy birds that used to be made by hand. Bob automated that process, mimicking that shape of women actually squeezing marshmallows out of a tube. The depositor machine Bob invented is a company secret. So secret, we can't even show it to you. What we can reveal, though, is the basic DNA of what makes up these little tasty treats. Sugar corn syrup, and then of course a little bit of gelatin to give it its form. It's all mixed together in giant kettles until it boils. Before long, it becomes creamy, delicious marshmallow. Looks nothing like a peep yet, though. Once the hot marshmallow mixer reaches the perfect consistency, it gets two secret ingredients that make the peeps extra special. There's air that's pumped into it, and then a little bit of love. Love right there in the marshmallow? That must be why we can't stop eating them. You may not be able to see the love being added, but the air is pumped in through giant aerators. Now it's time to turn this stuff into adorable little birdies. And here, we enter the highly classified part of the operation. So one secret we hear of Just Born is actually how we deposit the chip. And that's a family secret, but if I had to describe it, as you can imagine, marshmallow does get squeezed out into that familiar chick shape onto a bed of sugar. Whatever's happening in that depositor, we do know this. It happens a lot. On an average day, we make about 5 million peeps. That's over 2 billion peeps every year. Enough to circle the Earth twice. I'll give you a moment to picture that. Anyway, at this point, they're not peeps just yet. They still have to get their crunch on. The trademark coating of brightly colored sugar that gives them their classic texture. Sugar comes as white granulated sugar, and we'll color it one of the many favorite pastel colors. Pink, yellow, purple, orange, blue, green. Today's candy coating color is pink, which means first, red food coloring is diluted with water and then poured into huge rotating vats of sugar. Just a few turns and presto, our sugar is in the pink. And ready to hit the showers. The sugar showers, that is. No, you're not dreaming. We're really talking about actual showers of sweetness here. That's where all the sugar gets blown around through tubes that blow air all over the sugar, and that's how they get covered. And when the marshmallows finally get out, they are totally covered in colorful crystals. Looks pretty good, huh? But there's still something missing the one detail that makes every single solitary peep unique. They are still blind and they don't know where they're going, and so they make their way to the icing decorator. They get imprinted with their unique little eye imprints and not one chick is ever the same, and that's what gives them their peepsonality. Everyone loves a hot chick with a nice peepsonality. In fact, these chicks are so hot, they have to chill out for a bit on the cooling belt. And they're on this thing for quite a while. The belt itself is over 300 feet long. That's longer than a football field. We have it that long so the product, the marshmallow itself, can cool enough so it doesn't stick to our packaging. These crazy complicated assembly lines group the birds into boxes and then wrap them in that classic Peeps film I'm happy to report that most Peeps fans still enjoy the little birds the old-fashioned way. Even if sometimes they may have, well, waited a little too long after Easter. A lot of our fans, about 25% of them like them stale. We prefer to say, you know, aged like a fine wine. 